Is they start. All right. What's happening, good people? It's Dr. Nishan Nix, the CEO for the First Coast Leadership Foundation. I'm right here with our COO, uh, Mr. Seattle Jackson. Uh, right now is a very critical moment, a very critical time in our nation. Uh, I know for some of you, you've been hearing about the early voting precincts. You have to go to your specific precinct. You cannot go to any early voting site. You have to go to your specific precinct. And if you need help, you can text LOCATE to 74121. Text LOCATE to 74121. Uh, Ms. Jackson, anything you want to tell people? This is election day. Talk to us. Yes, so don't forget the polls close at 7 p.m. You have until 7 p.m. to cast your ballot. If you have to wait to 7 p.m. or 6.59, trust me, you can still vote. Please wait in the line, stay in the line. As long as you're there before 7 p.m., they will still take your ballot. So make sure you, you go in and actually your ballot goes through the machine and you see the little clock. If you don't see the clock, please let somebody know at the precinct that your ballot, that you want to question your ballot, whether it was counted or not. Uh, that's one of the things. The second thing is, as Ashad said, if you need to locate your ballot down, press text, locate to 74121, and you'll get a link in where you can find at your uh, location. All right, one last question, uh, Seattle. If they have their mail-in ballot or absentee ballot, does it have to go to their specific precinct or can they go to any polling site with that absentee ballot? Yeah, so today you can only turn your absentee ballot at the supervisor of elections office on Marlboro Street. All right, so that's one specific location for the entire city. Correct. All right, so once again, listen, we have to create that sense of urgency. For all of our young adults, huge shout out to all of our young adults. You are the ones that are really making a difference in this election. That's our 18 and up. Uh, thank you for taking this election serious.